To start, head to Firebase C. You will want to kill zombies until your Aether Shroud is fully charged. For this glitch to work, you will need Aether Shroud Tier 3 or higher. Once it's fully charged, you can teleport right through this door. This will help you save money for later, and you will also be able to do a pile-up glitch once the power is turned on. If you don't have Aether Shroud, don't worry, I'll be showing a toxic growth glitch spot later on. Once you have turned on all three ether reactors, head back to the spawn room. Then you'll need to stand on top of this basket. And if you are in the right spot, all the zombies will just pile up on the roof. You can stay at this spot even in the higher rounds, which is great if you are needing ethereum crystals. Drop down at the end of a round to pack a punch and grab perks. The first perk you should buy is Deadshot Daiquiri, since it will help you get headshots. You can also get a free Juggernaut perk by doing the bunny easter egg. Simply look at this bunny until it comes flying towards you. You will need to shoot three floating bunnies and then you'll be rewarded with a gold chest. Open the chest to get your free Juggernaut perk. You may also get lucky and receive a Wonder Weapon. This is a really great spot to use if you are playing solo. But there is another spot that you can go if you don't have Aether Shroud or if you just want something new to try. For this spot, you're going to need Toxic Growth, and it should be at least Tier 2, but Tier 5 is better. Simply place your Toxic Growth on the steps, and then stand up at the top. This is a really good spot to use, especially if you are playing in a public match. You will want a gun that can reload fast, and you'll want to make sure you are upgrading and pack-a-punching your weapon often. When a toxic growth gets destroyed, you can simply replace it with another. This spot works great in the low rounds, and keep watching the video if you want to see just how hectic it can get in the high rounds. You will want to do the defense missions to keep the Pack-a-Punch machine alive, and you can buy the war machine from the crafting table to help you out. Quickly get back to your spot as soon as the mission is over so you don't get swarmed. You should also buy Mule Kick and make sure it's tier 2 or higher so that the zombies drop ammo. But there is also an ammo box very nearby in case you don't have Mule Kick. Hope this one helps you out and make sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more. And that's all for now, I'll see you next time. And the secret word for this video is Toxic Stairway to Heaven. Go ahead and put that in the comments.